What's going on everybody? This is Giovanni from the Options Trading Channel. I placed a trade today. I placed a trade, but I couldn't have screwed it up any worse. I'll let you watch that video of my trade. It only lasted like two minutes. Completely blew it. Um, main reason, just keep in mind for whenever you're watching the video, Amazon came uh, came out with earnings right after the bell, screwed everything up for me, but I'll let you watch the uh, trading video. I have some really big, awesome news to tell you about. I opened up a new trading account. Now I'm still with Tastyworks, but that new trading account, I funded it with $10,000. I'm really confident in this strategy that I'm gonna start trading it with a bigger account, but I do have some rules that I wanna share with you and sort of my train of thought, I guess, if you will. I only want to trade with 10 to 15% max of the total account. So if I'm trading with a $10,000 trading account, I only want to be trading per trade, right? Per trade, 10 to 15%, which obviously equates to about $1,000 to $1,500 per trade. That'll enable me to trade with two call options at the time because volatility is still so high and the options are still so expensive. But those are my rules there. If I get myself into a bad trade, it's okay. I will lose in, in my head and my calculations from back testing and whatnot, I will lose around 30 to 40%. Obviously that's not max, but that's the average losing trade uh, that the strategy came up with over the last three or four years. So it's pretty good. And I'm still really excited, still really confident in the strategy. I just wanted to give you that update on the new trading account. So you're gonna see a whole new, basically starting from scratch account. Let's get to that trading video where I absolutely blew it. Let's get to it right now. What's going on everybody? This is Giovanni from the Options Trading Channel. We're getting a signal here towards the end of the day. The end of the day here. Let's go in on the 218 calls that expire in eight days. If we can close, if we can close and get a solid signal here, we've got four minutes until the closing bell. I don't know if we're going to get it. Alrighty guys, I went ahead and bought one just as a starting position of the 218 calls that expire in eight days. It looks like it's going to close with a uh, signal here. And I bought it, I believe at 498. Well, that was the quickest way to lose um, $85. I lost $85 in three minutes. And that's uh, pretty incredible. Look at that candle. This is the five minute chart on the, on the far right. Look at that candle after hours. The high is 219.31. The low is 217.54. I don't know what's going on. The one hour chart, we didn't get a solid signal, jumped the gun there, but that's what I get for trying to jump the gun there. So that was the quickest $85 loss that I've had in, in a long, long, long time. Moving on. <laughs> 